plaintiff, Holly Holadic, says the defendant is her boyfriend's sister, and she's nothing but a drug-dealing prostitute who sells her body online. Holly claims she added the defendant to her cell phone account, but she was forced to terminate the line because the defendant failed to pay the bill. Defendant Miranda Collins insists she is not a prostitute and claims Holly is addicted to pain pills and she's cheated on Miranda's brother several times with his friends. Miranda insists she paid the cell phone bill and therefore owes Holly nothing. Start with you. The reason why we're here today is because the defendant here is a drug selling escort. Um, she actually has a website where she sells her body for sex to get money. Um, She's well, a prostitute is what you're saying. Yes, she okay. is. Okay, all right. Um, but what really did it in And a me, drug dealer. Yes. What type of drugs does she do? Well, um, actually, we're going to get to that. What really okay. did it in for me was when she she approached uh, my boyfriend, her brother here, um, to sell him pills. Knowing that he struggled in the past with an addiction, mm -hmm. um, she approached him to sell him pills. Um, what type of pills? Viagra. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <it's, laughs> yes. <laughs> Probably pretty easy to get addicted to those. <laughs> Go ahead. Um, to my understanding, is opiates. Okay. Is what I don't specifically mm -hmm. know. Some type um, of. And and the reason why it affected our family so much was because he was doing really good. He struggled in the past with an addiction, um, and he was doing really good at this time. And that's when she approached him to sell him these pills after I had asked her not to do that. Um, and we, we do have a child together. And so that really set us back and it really affected our family in a negative way. Um, another thing that she has done is she actually put her kids at risk. She drove from Nebraska here to Chicago um, to pick up drugs to take back to Nebraska to sell with her children in the car. And your honor. And yet she hasn't paid you. Exactly. So she's a poor prostitute and a poor uh, <laughs> drug dealer who should find another line of work. Mm -hmm. It's a perfect example of somebody who takes from charity and doesn't deserve it. Um, I don't know what that means. Why don't you give me some background? <laughs> um, actually, Holly and I used to be good friends. We're obviously not friends no more, and I'm fine with that. Um, she is a cheater. She's cheated on my brother several times um, with his friends. She even brought me to the house to where she was cheating on the guy with um, right in front of my face. So I don't even know why he wants to be with her. Is that illegal? Uh, that's a complete lie, actually. She says what you do is illegal. Um, actually, what no. What you say I, she does is immoral. I don't know how I could be a prostitute and be a full-time mom of two children, single mom. Um, I have a full-time job and I go to school full-time. So okay. wherever, I don't know how I have time to do all that. She pawns her um, off on everybody all the time. While she's well, I gotta work go to work is, and I gotta she go, go to, to work school. school? <laughs> yep, actually. Um, does she work and go to school? Uh, I have no idea what she does. Well, then why did you say she sells time, drugs and stuff? At this if you time, said you have no idea what she does, be quiet. All oh, your credibility is gone. Aww. Go ahead, ma'am. Your credibility is... <laughs> go ahead. None. Um, also, um, she used me to get to my ex-boyfriend who had access to pills because she's addicted to pain pills herself. Um, what hydrocodone, kind? Hydrocodone and Xanax. Um, and... I mean, she's just, she's no saint. She's, you know, she, I think she's jealous of me and I think she hates me. And I think that's why she harassed me so much and why we're here today. All right. And you don't sell pills either. No, I don't. Okay. <laughs> Tell me about the cell phone termination fee. Um, well, in 2000, in May of 2013, Miranda approached me. She um, needed a phone and she asked me if I would be willing to add a line to my phone plan for her, um, which I agreed to. Uh, the phone was paid up until about October of 2013. Um, at that time, um, her boyfriend at the time, the father of her children, violated his parole and went back to prison. He was the one paying the bill prior to that. Um, in between October and December. Why did you say she did, you didn't know anything about her? I don't her? know why I said that, because I do know a lot about Miranda. You don't know why you lied? I don't know. Oh, At this okay. time. You, you, you acknowledge lying, but you don't know why you lied to me. Good enough. Now, let's get back <laughs> to the termination fee that Recently, you're I don't know. about. Yes. So uh, between October and December, um, Miranda paid me about a total of $40. We had an agreement that she would... Um, pay what she owed me at the end of the, at the beginning of the new year, which is January. Um, what would the total be? Um, well, it's just January. a cancellation fee that I'm asking for. I don't really care about the money that she didn't pay for those three months. Okay. Um, what happened was she came to Christmas dinner um, with a new phone. She had just say screwed you and got a new phone from a new carrier. She hadn't paid you. 
Yeah, correct. She had okay. not paid me. Okay, so you terminated because she hadn't paid you on time. Mm -hmm. Ma'am? Um, uh, she was paid every month on time. Um, there was a time in November where my sister, Cassie, had shut my phone off because we were arguing, suspended my service. The and phone that, that's in question? Yeah. And then Your sister was able to shut it yeah, off? Yeah. The one that was in her name? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is that true? Yeah, she had my password. When, um, when Miranda okay. told me that, she texted me and said that um, Cassie had shut her phone off. Um, Cassie told me, she said, this All right, that that's it was good fair. enough. Your, your sister shut your phone off. Yeah, for Not no her. reason. Yeah, well, and then a couple, probably like a week or two later, she was shutting my phone off saying I wasn't paying my bill, which she did get paid. When was that? That was in December. And how did you pay her? Cash. Um, where were you all? Um, at my house. She was visiting? Yeah, coming to pick up. It was for the phone bill. She came to pick up the money? Yeah. And yet she hasn't paid you. Exactly. So she's a poor prostitute and a poor uh, <laughs> drug dealer who should find another line of work. Plaintiff Holly Halatic is dating the defendant's brother, and she claims the defendant is nothing but a drug dealing prostitute. All right. And how much did you pay her approximately? $60. $60. And that covered what time frame? From November to December. The previous month? Yeah. Okay. And so you say you paid it. it. And she says the reason you cut it off, because she didn't pay you? Yeah, she paid me $40 in October, and that was the last time I received it. Good enough. So her. she didn't pay you the $60 in November mm -mm. for, all right. Got it. And you have evidence of the payments? I have text messages. Because um, you don't. All you're telling me is cash, right? Y yeah, but I do have some evidence. What is that? Um, that it, the amount that was paid. By whom? By my ex-boyfriend to her. Oh, your ex-boy, you have a statement from him? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's see it, please. And you have what? Text messages mm -hmm. from whom? I have text messages between the two of us. Oh, that's certainly more reliable. <laughs> you and your ex-boyfriend still talk and communicate? Yeah, he's the father of my kids. So. Oh, okay. Why would you restrict my phone? I'll unrestrict it when you pay me. Your response, LOL. <laughs> Good. Good. You're a selfish little brat. Why didn't you deny owing? You didn't say, I don't owe you. You didn't debate whether you owed her. Your only response was to laugh at her. So I'm convinced that she owes you. $320 is your judgment. Have a good day. I don't even know what to say. Um, this is just a joke. Um, you're a cheater, Holly. You're no good. You're no better. Um, I hope you learned a lesson by... You're talking about yourself right now. Yeah, so, so are you. Yeah. Everything you hater. Like jealous, hater. <laughs> Nothing to be jealous about. I do not have... I'm very you. gorgeous, and I don't. I, I, I sell cars. I sell cars. I sell cars. You really? have a website, Marina. I sell cars. Really? What website? website?